we're out tonight on the streets of Atlanta. Very cold, brisk night. The temperature is actually 32 degrees Fahrenheit. And we're out here giving gloves and ear muffins to the homeless tonight. Trying to help them out a little bit. Trying to keep them from being out in this cold weather. Normally we would have blankets to give this year, but we don't have the blankets to give. So we're just giving little trinkets of gloves. You know, brand new gloves for the homeless and ear muffs for their ears to keep them warm. Hoping that that will be some blessing to them. My husband, Demario Phillips, is helping me out tonight. We are the three wise men. We come bearing gifts as though they did in biblical times. Um, we look forward to helping those who we can help. And then we have another man that needs a little help tonight. Trying to help those who are less than unfortunate. There's three pair of gloves and earmuffs we don't gave out tonight. Okay, looking for a few more. Yep, we are here running around in the city. Looking for the homeless. Trying to find them because I know they're trying to get somewhere to get more. So we can give out these gloves and earmuffs. Got on gloves and mittens anyway. Hold on, I'm gonna be down for here. Yeah, trying to find their way. Trying to keep warm, get out of this cold tonight. I can't see you. No, he ain't homeless. <laughs> no, he good. He ain't homeless. Like he looking for some other things to do. What's over there in that corner over there? Those people over there. I just seen somebody put up like a little cardboard. Board up. Yeah. Oh, is that a lady with a baby carriage? Looks like she got a stroll. Okay, well I would hope that she is not homeless out here. Nah, she might be waiting on the bus. Yeah, she is. Yeah, she waiting on the bus. So where you going now, sir? Going down by the courthouse. City Hall. Okay, City Hall East, here we come. No, we're going right here. City Hall downtown. Oh, okay. You might need a whole lot when you go out there to because there'd be a lot of them down there. We're gonna give out what we got. And when it's gone, it's gone. We do everything we do in Jesus' name. Yes, we do. You know, it's not much, but it's a little something. More than what they got. Just thank the Lord that we're able to. Yes, we are.
know they down there on that street by the Civic Center a lot. Right, well, I'm gonna go up and loop around because I think it's on right there. All right. Anybody down there? I'm gonna loop around and make sure. Maybe they be in the little cut. They probably trying to feel that cold breeze tonight. Yeah. I appreciate you. Just do what I gotta do. No. I would want somebody to come out here trying to keep me warm. And if it was me. in my back and all of this. Wash it. You have made it a part of your mission as well. And I thank God for you. Don't see anybody down there. Always kind, especially during the winter months. There you go, one right there. See, this is why we are here. For brothers like this, or we don't know if it's a brother or a sister that's lame over here. Is it one over there? That's why it's always important to bring food because a lot of times, even though they, they're they they're cold and they want to be out of the warm, they want to be warm, but they're hungry as well. And that's why we here at the Three Wise Men, we really need your donations for folks like this gentleman right here that's laying in up under a building. That is a building. That is a business, I'm sorry. Condominiums. And condominium homes sleeping at the very bottom. You know, we don't know when we may be on the bottom. It's one, two, three. One, yeah. one two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good Lord Jesus. Look at all these homeless people out here tonight. Wait a minute. You don't have no food. You got to go. Two. Four, five, two, three, six, seven, eight. That's one. That's one. I got six. One, two, I got six. Three, four. Okay. I got more gloves if you need them. These are homeless people that are out here tonight. Gloves are being my food, my brothers and my sisters. Trying to keep warm on these church grounds. Isn't this crazy in front of a church, but yet they're homeless and in need? Why is our people going through this? We have to do what we can to help. You know, not very much, but we do our best. You know, the Lord has called us to do a lot of things, but. Trying to 
to keep women. I'm trying to keep women in this cold time. One over here up under the steps, Lord. When can we stop the homelessness in the city of Atlanta in which we live in? This is what 912 Entertainment and the three wise men do. They come out and try to help those who don't have. Well, it's so dark out there, you can't even see this time. I got two. Wait a minute, let me give you another glove. I might not have any more of those. I have a glove. How many gloves do you need? Gloves to keep the people in on the night. Well, that's what we do. We try our best. Got women on the street sleeping on the street. We have to do something about this. When does it stop? When does it stop? That's it. Let me take one of the cakes and get them and then pull out. Okay. So they can have something on the stomach. All right. How they gonna cut it? They gonna break off from it. Okay. It's bread. Yeah. It's something. Yeah, I think so. It's a cake. Y'all gonna have to share it. It's a pound cake. All right, God bless you. Baby, go on and give them two. You think that's going to be enough? Yeah, that's good enough. Okay. Might got a knife. Might just say, hey, go a knife. Mm-hmm. So he got up. He wants some cake, too. Praise the Lord. Look at my husband. He then gave a pound cake. Lord, with a testimony in that. A man named Jesus. I ain't forget about y'all. Just want to thank the Lord for blessing us. They able to be, to, for us to be able to be a blessing, you know. You know, we we gave them a pound cake. It wasn't much, but it was better than, than giving them nothing. A pound cake, some gloves, and some earmuffs for their ears to keep them warm. Yeah, you know. You know, and a little something in their belly. It was about eight of them, eight or nine of them out there tonight, wasn't it? In that one little spot, hub, hubbing them together, huh? Yep. Well, praise the Lord. They all accept the, the gloves and earmuffs except for one. Really? Yep. Why? That one, that one said they, they couldn't wear the gloves or the earmuffs, but they was fine. So, all right. You know. But I told told the one guy to make sure everybody gets some of that pound cake. All right, now. To God be the glory on this cold night. Lord, may you warm their bodies and their soul. May they know you, Lord God, in the giving tonight that you came forth to give, Lord God. Okay, Not so you. much as a man, but you, Lord. Okay, you got um, got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven pair, seven, uh-oh, okay. Eight, nine, ten, eleven pair. Eleven pair gloves. That means we have to go back to Jenny's and get more. Oh, what a night, what a night. God going to provide. 912, that's our number. That's 912 Entertainment, doing what we always do. And the Three Wise Men Nonprofit Organization, we are going to do it with the glory of God. 
And to all my people that I manage, I, I come to you and tell you that I, if you take a $100 out your pocket, I take $100 out of my pocket, and we can help provide for the homeless for this Christmas. Know you. Why you say that? They ask for blankets. Yeah, I don't have any blankets. Um, it saddens me that I don't. <laughs> Merry Christmas, man. You, you must got a lot of ones on you tonight. No, nah, I gave that other dude a final deal. Oh, okay. Because he was in a wheelchair. Oh, okay. And that dude, I said he just wanted some ones. He wasn't going to buy no booty tonight. So he was going to get him some meat. <laughs> no booty tonight. Yep. Lord, the homeless out here paying for sex. Jesus, we trying to get them off the street, Lord, and feed them and, and give them a little warmth, and they they still crazy. But, Lord God, we ask that you heal their minds. Ah, take them off the street, Lord God. Restore their spirits. They really on babe. Babe, please be careful out here because here, but no, these dope, these some of these guys are dope dealers, and I really don't want you down here because they I'm really. I'm gonna pull up though. No, just be careful. If you, I'm gonna pull up though. No. I'm gonna pull right down that street. <sighs> Not with your jury on. Baby, they, how they gonna see my trigger? I'm on jacket zipped up. Okay. All right. Do you see the homeless people down here? Uh, I do, but they down here, they doing their thing. They selling dope right now. And I really don't want you down here. Because this is right here. Now on this side right here, they here. These are the ones you want to deal with. And they already got a bunch of stuff. And don't take out no money out your pocket. Well, I'm not. not down here. of the homeless and this is how they're living on the streets of Atlanta now some of them will wear those gloves but some of them will sell them for drugs we do what we can but we can't help everybody we just try That's you ain't no food. Nope. All right. Unless you got that cake, you want to give them a cake to share? All right.
is open. You know, you got, you got to stay with one of your girls. Well, whoever else is down here, it's a whole cake. Here. It's a pound cake. Whole pound cake, fresh. Just right. been baked. God bless you. We just gave her a whole pound cake to share with whoever's down here. A pound cake to share with whoever's down here, and it's fresh. Hey, this gloves good for me. All right. God bless, man. All right, here we go. They're behind places like this. Look at the city of Atlanta lit up beautifully for Christmas. How about that? All the lights, all the attractions, Fox Theater, the tavern. What a beautiful city to live in. But the reality of it all is there's another side. 